When you purchase the resistance exercise band, you have three choices. Red one is the lighter resistance, green is medium, and blue is the heavy resistance. When you receive the, the exercise band, you'll get a straight piece of band. I usually recommend uh, putting a knot on either end of the band, and this will help you to do either single arm or single leg exercises. You'll use the knot as an anchor in your doorway, any doorway in your house. Just place the knot behind the door and close the door on it so that when you apply the resistance, the band does not slide out from behind the door. It, it's just like having somebody hold the other end of the rubber band. So with this you can do any type of shoulder extensions, you can do your rows, um, you can do biceps, and you can do chest press. So you really don't need to depend on anybody else to hold it. As long as you make a knot on one end and you have a doorway, you can do pretty much any upper extremity exercise. If you place both knots behind the door, It'll create a loop, and then you can do your um, single leg exercises such as your hip extensions or your kickbacks. Uh, you just place your leg inside the loop, both knots are behind the door so that the resistance band does not come loose. So that's what I would suggest for you to do once you purchase the resistance exercise band. So as I was saying, for the single leg exercises using the resistance band, put a knot on both ends. Place both knots behind the door, close the door, make sure that you lock the door so that anybody on the other side doesn't open the door. And then place one leg in the loop. And you can do hip extensions, adduction, flexion, pretty much any single leg exercise that you have in, in the uh, video library.